Yo, man, what's good, YouTube? Brace your boy, 0511, aka Ricky Raymond Jr., man. Y'all see, I'm back out here with another video, man. I'm pretty sure y'all been wondering, you know, yo, all day, where you been at, man? I'm not too sure when I'll drop this video, bro. So <laughs> I could be like dropping this next week, and I said it's like a week earlier. So yeah, bro, hopefully I'm back by this time, man. Or you know what? We're just gonna go by this video, man. We ain't gonna worry about the past. I'm at the future, man. So um, let's go ahead and hop into the video at hand today, man. I'm sorry, do you know I have been missing upload days, bro? I've been going for like a week now, but I'm back, big fella. So today I'm gonna give you guys three tips, man, on how to uh improve your shooting on NBA 2K17, whether it's from Pro M to my career to uh my team, man. Even one of these will help for my team. Uh, I'll let you guys know when that one is. I believe it's act yeah, it is the actual it actually is the second one, man. So uh yeah, man, I'm gonna give you I'm gonna give you guys three tips, man, how you can improve your shooting in NBA two K seventeen. Doesn't matter what position you are, you can be a glass cleaner, you can be a point four, you can be a playmaker, you can be a stretch you know, stretch big or sharpshooter, doesn't matter, man. So let's go ahead and hop into it at hand today, man. For number one, bro, and this is like one of the this is the biggest thing to be honest, you guys. Like this is the most important one of them all, bro. Is that you guys for my career pro am and park players, man? You guys need to go hit that my career scene up, bro. Y'all need to go to my career and go ahead uh shoot sixty percent from each one of your spots. If you guys don't know what I'm talking about, if you go down to your player stats and you can um you click the little I think you like click left trigger or something like that, bro. I can't remember, man, because I'm not right on my I'm not at my game system right now, so I'm just kind of going off the top of my head. But if you guys know how to go back and check your stats and all that from your games and stuff like that, man. It's in that same exact place. So when you go check your badges at and stuff like that, keep scrolling, keep scrolling over, and you'll find this little box. Bro, it's gonna have your sh uh, shooting chart. It's a shot chart, and it's gonna have it. If your shot chart is red, then that means that that's a hot spot. If it's blue, then that means that it's a cold spot. So wherever you pull up, man, from that, if you pull it up from your hot spot, you will have a higher chance to hit a green release. If you guys have ever noticed from my my player, I normally pull up from mid range because I know that that is one of my hot spots. I always pull up from the corners because I know that's one of my hot spots, corner threes, things like that. So I have all my hot spots, man. So trust me, these hot spots are really going to help you, man, get a better chance of getting a green release. If you guys have a limitless range badge, make sure you guys have that red um, shot chart, man, right there where you're trying to shoot from like half court and stuff like that. Make sure you have that, bro, if you want to be pulling it from dumb deep. All right. So let's go ahead and hit the second one, man. Hit up the second, uh, number two, big fella. All right, number two goes for every mo every single mode, whether it's play now, um, my team, my career, park, pro -em. This goes for all of them, man. Use your analog stick to shoot, man. Now, if you guys know how to use um, your analog stick to do layups or um, your analog stick to do dunks, man. If you guys do not know how to do that, man, let me know down in the comment section. I'll do it another tutorial for you guys so you guys can know how to do that, man. But it's simple and easy, bro. All you have to do is that you need to pull down your right analog stick down. And it's almost like using this exact way as your shot meter pops up and everything. If you have one, if you still have your shot meter on, it pops up, bro. So it's exactly like just holding the square button or X button for uh, Xbox Ones and uh, square for PlayStation. It's the same exact way, you guys, man. So, you know, same exact shot meter, excuse me. So when you're using it, 2K already said, they've already came out and said, yes, you get an extra boost for this, man. And I've seen people at Park be pretty much unstoppable at shooting with the uh, little... um. The analog stick, bro, because they can pull up from anywhere they want to, bro. I haven't really got it mastered down yet, so I'm still working on it, bro. But trust me, you got it's going to help you guys. I promise you, it's pretty much unstoppable. It's overpowered right now. 2K really needs to patch it. So make sure you go ahead and use it, man. This is when I'm making this video, bro. Patch 7 is still out, man. So, you know, patch they haven't made patch 8. Know that this is still overpowered, bro. Trust me. So, uh, in order to use it, bro, you like I say, you pull down the shot, right meter, you know, your right stick downward and just like a regular shot meter and if you want to shoot a bank shot aka backboard use backboard you push it up forward now when you shoot if you look down by your shot meter there will be this little green arrow i would love to show you guys game clips of it man but for some odd reason my clips keep uh corrupting so i'm having problems with that right now I'm trying to figure it out but when i do man hopefully i can show you guys again maybe i'll make a um you know a better version of this video man but for right now we don't have that all right and number three, man, this is just really just a simple one. Experiment in your my court, man. Instead of just taking all these these two things I just told you, 
<coughs> excuse me. Instead of just taking them and going straight to Parker Pro M, go to your my career. Bro, I mean, go to your my court, man. Experiment with jump shots. Use custom jump shots. I, mean, I know you have to go to Coach K, man. So make sure you keep checking your messages and keep looking for Coach K if he uh calls you, man. Or text, excuse me, text you. Make sure you go ahead and read your text so you can see if you can get a custom jump shot. Mess around with some of the jump, jump shots. Keep looking through jump shots, man. See which ones you like. Maybe you can customize them, bro. And just hit that my core. If you guys want to know how you can get more of a realistic um, experiment going on, if you go to your uh, settings and you change it from, uh, you know, your uh, my career settings or, you know, your gameplay settings, if you change it to all-star, uh, that's what Park is played on, man. So, uh, Park is played on All Star, so that gives you more of a realistic experiment, man. So, you can go out there, you know, mess with dribble moves and mess with, um, you know, just shoot. I'm not doing a dribble tutorial, bro, but I'm talking about, you know, shooting tutorial. So, just go ahead and use that, man. Mess around with it and make sure you know, get down to your spot, you know, see where you can shoot from your green spot, see where you get most of your green releases from. And I promise that's going to help you, man. I do it all the time when I'm experimenting with new jump shots, man. So, uh, <clears throat> that's pretty much it, bro. I'm not going to lie. That's all. That's really it, too, man. It's nothing really special to it. We have to hit, you know, cheat code XXB393. You know what I mean? It's nothing like that, man. It's nothing too extreme. It's kind of simple. Um, I will be making more tutorials, bro. So, if you guys have any, you know, type of tips that you want to see me do. <coughs> Excuse me. If you guys want to see me do any types of tips, man, let me know down in the comment section. And I will get to it, big fella. I will do it as soon as possible. Like I said, I'm sorry for the wait. You know, I'm sorry I've been going for a while. Uh, if you guys, if you, you know, I know y'all heard me coughing, man. I've been sick. I just pretty much got my voice back now. That's why I'm making this video. And like I said, also, I was on a, uh, I was on a uh, vacation trip, man. So if y'all are new to my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button, man. Um, like I said, if you have any type of questions or tips, you need tips for other uh, tutorials, let me know down in the comment section. I will make it for you guys, man. So I hope you guys did enjoy your day at school today or whatever time you guys see this right at work. It's your boy, Day0511, a.k.a. Rick Raymond Jr. Don't forget to like this video if you enjoy. Comment any feedback or if you guys have any questions, ask me down in the comment section, man. A uh, shout out to my boy, Odell103, bro, for the shout out. Thank you, man. Uh, much do, uh, you know, much love. And thank you for supporting my channel, man. Thanks for all y'all who supports my channel rocking with me right now, man. So don't forget to turn on your notifications. And, uh, yeah, I'm out.